Here we go, three, two, one, fight, and there you have it. We're gonna see Cooler get a good spot in the Mega Health and the, uh, uh, and the uh, Yellow Armor Room, but look at that TCM, oh, gets no. the frag and blows himself up. We have equalization. Uh, 15 seconds of this match, and CZM's gonna grab the rocket launcher, go for the red armor. Uh, Cooler did not want that one to happen. CZM, although they were equalized, actually got the better of the two scenarios. Oh yeah, he dropped down right into a 50, folded up with the red. It was a great position for him to fall out to after a mini machine gun battle. Now, CZM will grab another 50, make his way around on the prowl for Cooler. We're in a 0-0 situation here, and uh, despite having a frag apiece, sort of, CZM has, has control. He's at 100, 103, but he gets rocked in the face with a rocket. He's now down to 44, 15. Cooler is at 104, 16. So these are these guys are going to have the amount of armor. CZM from the middle level pulls out the shaft. He should be able to get it right there. And as Cooler drops down, which was not a smart move, CZM does get it. However, he's at 25 points out. He picks up a 25, 4, 50 right there. There's another 50 on the ledge, but he's not going to grab it yet. There it is. He's back up to 165. Now going to try to defend that Mega Elf room, but gets kicked out by Cooler. 62 points to help. He picks up the 50 down by the teleporter. Looks for that yellow armor, anticipating uh, a Cooler going for it. It's still up, and Cooler does run right into his rocket, but he gets a frag and ties it up. One minute and 30 seconds, and uh, so far, pretty, pretty equal match. Cooler is, uh, you know, just struck his way back into that, powered his way back into it with the rocket, picks up the red, 103 and 147 for Cooler. He'll make his way down. Uh, CZM will just dodge out of view. CZM not in the greatest position to be fighting Cooler right now, but once get away, comes for with the LG, 125. Cooler still happy to hold off, happy to control. Go for the, go for the mega help. It will be an exchange of rockets, double frag. Neither of them will get it. Machine gun out for Cooler, chasing out CZM in midair. He will be almost at it now. CZM. Nice. With the machine. Nicely done. Very nicely done. 145.50 for CPM finishing him off with his machine gun. But is that going to be all he's going to be able to get? Ooh, the cooler outside the teleporter. And now CZM is forced to wait. He can't make the rocket jump, so he's going to pick up the shotgun and hope that Cooler's not waiting for him. Let's check. Yeah, he's waiting. Right there he comes out, but he can't get the machine gun there. If he would have waited just one more second. Oh, oh no! Oh, cooler pops him up in the air, and CZM blows himself up. Two minutes, 32 seconds in this game, and we got a tie game once again. Cooler will not let... CZM pull away. Cooler is in buoyant mood and no one will stop him. He had to call home to say, I'm going to win this one and let's see whether his call was right. You, you know what? If you've ever seen Cooler give that really smug smile, I know that he had that on his glowing face when CZM blew himself up like... <laughs> And to three minutes now on the clock, we've got Cooler with this smug smile. It's two to two. Ooh, wow. He lands another nice rocket on CZM as he's waiting for that red armor. And now Cooler's just going to watch from the top. He drops another rocket on CZM and he goes through the teleporter. CZM, he's hurting just a little bit. He's at 69.42. Switch it back over to Cooler. He's at 185.45. That yellow armor is up and Cooler's going to wait for it. A lot of grenades coming down. He's going to fire a rocket of his own. And I think he countered those. He knew, but CZM jumped right towards Cooler, lands a grenade right in his face, but it's not going to do enough damage to him. Still under 100, and the LG comes out, Cooler takes the lead, 3-2, three to two, 3 minutes and 39 seconds on the clock, and CZM's got his work cut out for him. Yes, he does, but what a game we have here. There is no one who can you know, exactly know how this one is going to go. We've had the lead exchange two or three times. Cooler now will do his level best to hold on to it. Wick, grab that Mega, 174, grabs the yellow as well. Moving away, but CZM landing a lot of rockets there. Deflating that Mega and the yellow armor, 65 HP. Cooler spies the red rocket landing down in front of him, 65, 100. Now the rocket from CZM. Cooler just going to rocket jump out of there and pick up the 50 and get away with his life. I think that was a smart move by Cooler. He could have gone through the teleporter, but I think CZM was too smart for him. He, he would have been right there to, to finish him off. So he does make the rocket jump, sacrificing a little bit of armor and health. And there's the yellow for him. He's still in the lead, three to two. We got four minutes and 24 seconds on the clock. He finds CZM with his back turned to him, gets some more uh, shafts on him, and uh, CZM did pick up the mega there. But all the ready down to 78 points of health as Cooler was able to deplete that with his lightning gun, looking for that yellow armor. Now I'm going to switch to CZM and I'm going to stay on for a while. We've got a fight here. By the grenade launcher, jump at CZM down. He blows himself oh, no. up, and we have no score on that one, but we do have equalization, and that may play in CZM's favor. 
It will, depends where he spawns. He's only got that shotgun, will spy that yellow armor, will collect, gets himself out of there before Cooler will uh, realize it. And now we're a question of where is Cooler because CZM is just lying in wait, picks up the rocket, has that 50 in the yellow, and uh, will grab the LG. CZM just on the prowl now, realizes he's still that one frag down and must equalize this one back up. Five minutes, 16 seconds on the clock. They're going to come around the corner. CZM takes the brunt of that battle. 40 points of health remaining. He's going to go to the 325. He picks up two of them for 90 points of health. He's still down by one. Picks up another 50 and sees the yellow armor. He's going to grab that. He's now over. He sees that there uh, is a rocket launcher available. I thought he was going to go for that. I thought that's why he made the U-turn, but he did not. Waiting now for that mega. He knows exactly where Cooler is, but Cooler has his eye on him as well. Let's switch over to him. Look at that health and armor. 170. 650. CZM doing a great job chopping that up with the LG in 5 minutes 50 seconds on the clock. He, this is just absolutely a fantastic game. There hasn't been a frag in about 2 minutes and Cooler still has the lead. Oh, bad rocket jump there from Cooler. Will put himself in a bad position. CZM striking down from above. Cooler will get out of there but you have to earn each and every one of these 5 frags we have had and boy have they. Yellow armor picked up by Cooler still at 100 and 110 moving himself away to spy CZM. Rocket's Exchange there. LG coming forward from uh, from CZM. Still unable to do the damage, but that rocket will just pull Cooler away from CZM's face. Uh-oh, and CZM makes the rocket jump up to the top. Cooler made the same one. 71.52 for Cooler after that rocket jump. Look at CZM. 171.136. Let's spy him for a while because he's certainly in a position to tie this game up. So far, a pretty low scoring game, but DM13... On the line of those scoring games. Six minutes, 42 seconds on the clock. Shaft battle on the top of the rocket launcher bridge. CZM down to 43 points out, and Cooler leaves that wow. situation. So he only has 10 points out. CZM gets the shotgun kill and ties this game up three to three. He's now got 178 health and 32 armor, and we have got one hell of a game here. Seven minutes on the clock, 30 seconds away from halfway through. CZM's gonna make another rocket jump to the top, grab that yellow armor. He knows exactly where Cooler is at all times, and now Cooler. I think is on the other side of the window. Before he was fine, he was protected, nothing was going to hurt him, and now all of a sudden, uh, it, there's no glass in between these two. Three to three, this one's anyone's game. And he got used to it from DM6 as well, because he was in that very same position. He was in control, he stopped, you know.